Okay, we've got plenty of action coming up. I was just looking over some of the matches to come before we see Kojo uh, and Mr. X and Randy Savage. I want to get the uh, king out here. Uh, I'll say it right off the top. Uh, not as comfortable a situation as when Jerry had the uh, belt, uh, but that's the part of it. I think the thing that irritates me the most is the way that you lost the belt to Randy Savage, Jerry. Well, Lance, uh, you know I don't, I don't, I don't really want to talk so much about the the way I lost the belt. Uh, Tux Newman was out here saying he didn't want to show the film. I don't, I don't really want to see the film well, either. No, I think That's, it's only fair that well, the you're people talking about have past an... history, Lance. It's no, it's no. You don't need to live in the past. The belt was lost. That's all there is to it. We don't, uh, you know. Uh, I think there's not anybody out here that uh, that has any doubts that Tux Newman has something to do with the match. Uh, all I got to do now is think about the future, Lance. Yeah, I understand. You want to rematch Jerry and all, but but it, it is only fair because of the way that they're out here bragging about what a great thing it was and all of that. And sure, they got the belt, but I think it's only fair, and I really insist that the people have an opportunity to see what Newman had to do with the match in there, Jerry, and I want to show it right now. It, it, it's, if you will, please, to bear with us on this because... Take a look at the end of the action that took place when Jerry Lawler lost his Southern heavyweight title to Randy Sa Pay close attention, if you will, please. The strap comes down. Lawler's bumping Savage. Referee trying to stop him. End of the turn buckles in the air and as Lawler with the slammy, boy weakened from 24 minutes and a half of wrestling, almost fell over. The referee knocked down. Newman pulls the legs of Savage, gets him to the underneath the ropes. Lawler going out there, touch Newman. Drills. There it was. Now, I, I, I know that you saw that. First, Newman is back there grabbing at your leg. He, he, all right, come on, touch. You now, this is, this, Lawler. He you didn't put us up to anything thing. about it. The that's people garbage. needed to that's see it. That's baloney. They didn't see anything. What they saw is something that Lawler doctored up. He had no business. They didn't doctor I'm anything. I'm going to sue you, Lawler. I am going to put you out of business. I'm All gonna, right. I'm going to do, I'm going to fix you. I'm, right now, I'm going to fix you. I you would, know, I tell you, if you know what's good for you, you better get out of here and leave him. Uh, he's always going to do something in there, and all we were going to do was give the people an opportunity to show in there. There's no question about it. He had a hold of your leg. He distracted you, pulled you over there, and then said, all right, now, Tux, we're not going to have any trouble in here. We don't want any kind of trouble going in here. I know, sweet daddy Seeky, and you brought this him in. my boy. He just got off the plane from Europe. He's here right now. Look at him, Waller. Yeah. Look at him. No trouble. Now, we don't want any trouble out here, Seeky, so uh, if you just sell it, no problem. Now, come on, Tux. I don't want any kind of difficulties or any problems out here. Zeke, the man's not afraid of you, but please, we don't need any kind of fight out here. Sweet Daddy Zeke, one of your guys, I am sure. Please, Jerry. Sir, I mean, you just might as well get him out of here and get yourself out of here right now. How, I don't have to get anybody out. How are you? How are you? What are you doing? What are you doing? Just a minute, just one second. You think you know this man. But I'll tell you one thing, I know him. And a lot of my people in Canada knows this man. I remember we needed help. I do quite a number of benefits in Canada. And I sent a wire to try to get this man down there. And my wire was answered. This man hopped a plane and came straight to Canada 
As a matter of fact, he was only supposed to stay two weeks. He wound up staying a whole month, and he would not accept any expense money. And I'll tell you one thing, Jerry, I'd like to say, from me and my people in Canada, I wish you all the luck in getting the title back. Tut, 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 you just wait a minute. I have something to say to you as well. I'm not your boy. I am not a boy. Not only that, I heard you what you were saying about them, they. Well, if the fellas that you're managing, just a minute, don't interrupt me. The fellas that you're managing, if they will accept being called boy or they or them, I heard you say that they're only good in football, baseball, and uh, other things. Well, let me tell you something. Just a minute. I came all the way from Europe, all the way from Europe, and I knew that I would have to wrestle Jerry. But under the circumstances, you calling me boy, them, they, I don't need that. I might have to leave tomorrow, but I will not let you manage me because I don't like words like that. Boy, them, they. Speaky, you signed a contract with me. You understand, man? Don't you don't fulfill the contract. contract. You're never going to wrestle. you never going to wrestle anywhere. I'll see that. Don't worry. This what? is what I think about this. Uh -huh. That's what I think about your contract. And don't, let me tell you something. I don't even want you in my sight. You have the nerve to call me a boy. I don't want you in my sight. I think I'm going to like this man you right pay here. You pay me. Okay. You pay. I'll make sure you'll uh, never wrestle anywhere. Hey. I'll feel. I'm going to play. Maybe that shows you you can't tell everybody hey. what to do. Let me tell you something. I might have hurt my, my plans around here. I hope not. But I, like I said, I might have to leave tomorrow. But I'll tell you one thing. I will not let that man manage me. Well, I appreciate those sentiments, Jerry. Lance, let me say something. You know, I heard you announce last week that Sweet Daddy Seeky was going to be wrestling in here. Now, I met this man about seven years ago, and he's been a wrestling star for many, many years now. International star. Not only that, he wrestled up in Canada. He also does a lot of charity work up there. He worked with a crippled children's hospital in Canada. That's what he was talking about. I did go up there, as did a lot of other wrestlers, and we helped out, tried to raise a lot of money up there. That's why I was so disappointed, Seeky, when I heard that you were going to be here wrestling for Tux Newman. You don't need a jerk like Tux Newman, and I'm glad to see you see the light on this kind of a jerk. I'll tell you one thing. I just don't, uh, I don't like that kind of talk, and I'd rather leave. No, no, I'd rather I'm, leave. I'm Let me you. say this. No, don't leave. No, exactly. <laughs> Let me say this. We don't want you to leave. The people in the Memphis area, the people in the South here, have not seen this man wrestle, and I want them to have a chance to see him wrestle, and we want you to stay, we want you to wrestle. I'm going to talk to, I'll, I'll go back here and talk to Eddie Marlin. Have you got your tights You don't with have you? to, I don't need tights. We can do it right now. <laughs> we can do it just like that. Hey, I tell you, tight? whether you got a contract with him or not, I want to see you go. I've heard about Sweet do? Daddy Seeky for a long time. No way, we got to get a match. We got to get Eddie Marlin to get a match. <laughs> He not, he's not slowing down, Jerry, I don't believe. Going into the ring now, Sweet Daddy Siki is over talking to Tojo Yamamoto. Uh, Tojo is scheduled to go in. <laughs> he's got his street clothes on. Sweet Daddy Siki, is that okay, Eddie? Huh? <laughs> yeah, I like that attitude myself. Sweet Daddy Siki in his street clothes, Mr. X, who was going against Tojo Yamamoto. And uh, let me get over here by the bell, Jerry. As uh, it looks like we're going to get a match and get to see Sweet Daddy Siki. Whoa! He grabbed him big hip toss again. Lance, all I can tell you is that, as I said, this guy has been wrestling for a number of years. Top black wrestlers in the in the entire country. He's got a name that's preceded him all you know Everywhere. all over the place, and uh, he just hadn't been wrestling in the states for a while. He's been on a tour of Europe. He's wrestled in Canada for a long, long time, and I'm just glad for the people here to get the man going. And there's a special.
especially right there. Look at that son of a gun go. One, two, three. And did it take him a short time? You got it. 34 seconds, 34 seconds day. So much for Mr. X. And sweet daddy Seeky really putting some moves on Mr. X as he put him down. And by golly, I'll tell you what. In his street clothes yet. <laughs> He's over there with a good group of Cub Scouts that we have. And we were tickled to death that he ran up there in the ring and decided to do it. I was even more tickled that he, uh, that he tore up that contract of uh, Tux Newman's so that he doesn't have to horse with Tux Newman anymore. Danny, hey, congratulations. You didn't Where take you? long right there, buddy. No. And you can even do better Listen. than that with tights on, right? I can do a lot better. A lot better with Tice. And I'll say again, that Newman, I don't know why he brought me all the way here. I was touring. I was touring in, in no, Europe no, stay out there. We got with a my band. Go ahead. And I was uh, playing music. And he brought me all the way down here just to call me boy. I'll tell you something. i like to tell my people out there, if the promoter if the promoter will give me permission to wrestle down here, you can rest assured that you will not be sorry that I'm here. I like it. I like it. Talk to Eddie Marlin back there. Sweet Danny Seeky, delighted to have you here on Championship Wrestling. Thank you, fellas, for coming out here with, uh, with Sweet Daddy and... Whoa, he gave us quite a demonstration Boy, in a he? hurry, babe. Wow. I'll tell you, Sweet Daddy Seeky, and I think the biggest thing I loved about it was the fact that it was a shock to Tux Newman when he tore that contract yeah. up. We're going to take time out be back in a moment.